Await my order. Whoa, that's quite a bit of units there. Um, where are my reinforcements? Will they show up? Oh yeah, they probably will show up after I start the battle. Can I like deploy it before that or something? I don't know. Okay, we will move quickly because our reinforcements are coming from behind. And we will try to go for their generals first. Let's see what kind of formation these guys take up. There's a river here. I'm, oh no, this. My reinforcements are coming from behind. Okay, actually, I'm just gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for my reinforcements to show up. Because I'm not gonna be fighting at full strength. Well, I want to be fighting at full strength. And these guys right there, I'd better start showing up quickly. Okay, I'll just get them to go here. Might, I'm probably going to speed this up soon. So we don't wait the whole time. We have lots of spearmen. Pretty powerful. Which is a bit annoying because my um I have Poland is cavalry reliant and Well, let's just say Spearmen plus head on cavalry charging is not a very good tactic. And I'm probably going to bring my, I'm going to try to go f outflank here and go for the um, Holy Roman Empire's um, general. Now I'm a bit reluctant to speed this up quite yet, but I'm probably going to get my troops information first while, and then speed it up. Okay, that's all my troops, oh. that's my troops right here. We'll get these guys to go together. Oh no, these guys are coming up. Okay. We'll go here. And get my infantry to line up. Whoops, not that way. Kind of like this, though we'll probably rearrange it later. And the one of their disadvantages is they spread themselves out a bit too thin so we can somewhat outflank them I guess and are they advancing or not? we'll find out soon enough hope not, it's a bit too soon for that though I can meet my cavalry with their cavalry, my cavalry cannot match theirs general's bodyguard or not Considering I have P.S. Nobles, one unit of General's Bodyguard, two units of Sereltsi, and one unit of Prussian Auxilia, which is coming right up. Yeah, I'm, I would like to speed this up a bit, but I don't know if the War Ramper is going to advance or not. Just speed it up just a bit. coming up yet? Now we just wait. Whoa. Okay, these guys are bunched together a bit too close for comfort. So we'll get our Pias Nobles right here. We'll get our General's Bodyguard right Working for some reason, damn it. We'll flank with the mounted crossbowmen on each side, and we can easily outrun their um, spearmen. We can try to go for a leer, try to leer these guys out, 
from the general's bodyguard and mounted cav away from the main body of the army and then just freaking pound them and if they lose it's not good for the morale if they um, lose their troops let's just say and then if they have more cavalry here we don't really have to worry about those too much I hopefully not um, I don't have any infantry archers which kind of sucks but then again they're pretty poor anyways <laughs> so I'm not missing out on too much though it would be nice to have some uh, infantry archers maybe crossbowmen as well but you know I guess not we'll have to make do with what we can and these guys are a bit oddly positioned we'll just move them up very so slightly for each of them so they get into formation move them up just a little bit. We'll leave our main body here because we don't want us to get split up. <clears throat> and we have more reinforcements in the back. So we're waiting for these guys to show up. up I guess so they get here faster and I don't have to wait the whole game though I kind of put it on so on purpose a little earlier just so I could explain some stuff and just thinking out my strategies is what I'm gonna do because hey, I've been sup superior forces before but whoa it just doesn't but you never know They're technologically superior to me, which is quite a disadvantage, but it, we can deal with it. And we'll group our cavalry together. These guys just have mounted sergeants, which aren't great units. But since they chose to spread their cavalry out, I guess we could go for. Yeah, we're going for the general bodyguard first. So we're gonna try to lure them away. We're gonna approach from here, not from here, so uh, the spearmen don't charge us. And we'll just do hit and run until we decide to move up. Are they pulling back? Or what? Yeah, I don't like how these guys are spread out currently. Um, some of these guys here. Eugh. I hate when it goes to, like from left to right or something or whatever it was. It's just really annoying when I'm trying to make them face. I'm dragging from the right to the left, but it has to be from the left to the right or something. I don't know. And let's go. Woodsmen are decent, but they're not heavily armored as these guys. Okay, I think we're ready to move out. What are these guys doing? Keep, we'll keep these guys behind here because they have a captain there. Let's go! <clears throat> we'll move right here and we'll start firing on these guys and try to lure them away to um, attack us. Move a bit faster. <coughs> funny because the battles don't seem to have a higher like frame rate than the campaign map which is kind of amusing to me 
Don't know why that is, but it's still pretty funny and it's good for gameplay reasons. And there's the pink sun. <laughs> Looks pretty pink from here. <laughs> Cavalry is approaching. Now our horse archers are going to move here and then we'll get them to shoot. We're not going to make them shoot from too close to these guys and then we'll shoot at their general's bodyguard. Let's hope the AI is smart enough to come at us instead of just stand there like some stupid AIs <laughs> do. So yeah, the balance of forces is almost like exactly evenly matched. We have plenty of reinforcements, but they have uh, superior troops, and our reinforcements take a while to get here, so we might have to resort to using hit and run tactics a lot. And that's why we're going for their generals right now. There's a general's bodyguard right here, which we're going to hopefully try to leer away. Oh, they have archers right here. Oh god, no. Okay. That's fine. Um, we're gonna grab one of our units here. Let's see which. We're gonna grab our. And we'll, we'll use our Pias Nobles to take these guys out. Okay, move out. Hopefully, before they show up. Let's hope they stay behind those troops because they'll have to like arc over to shoot at us and then we'll bring some of our guys up. We are being attacked. We are being attacked. Oh god. Unit, okay. These guys are rushing out to meet us, I'm pretty sure. And actually we'll bring our Piaz nobles up. And we'll grab our general's bodyguard and our Prussian auxilia. Clear them into our little trap. Go! Charge! Are these guys coming for us or not? They are? Okay, let's hope we... We'll just try to get their general's bodyguard before that. We are going to pull back, and we'll get our horse archers to take these guys out. And these guys are separated somewhat. We'll try to lure them away from the main body. Crap. And move these guys out. I think I can pause so I can pull them back. These guys can shoot. These guys can run for their lives. Well, I think there's two units actually. Whoa, Prussian Auxilia took quite a hit. I should have watched. Watch them more carefully. Go, run, 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 run. try to hit them. Oh, no, we won't. We're actually going to try to hit them from behind, actually. Maybe. And the journal mounted sergeant. There's only one unit left. And they took 5% losses, which is actually not too bad. We get our journal, move our journal's bodyguard back up here. Yeah, I should have kept more careful watch over my Prussian auxilia. We are being attacked! These guys are getting shot at. pull these guys back. They're not much use to us anymore. And there's hardly any units. Are they moving all oh my god. 
no, no, they're just moving up. I'm pretty sure they are at least. Okay. There's like two units of General's bodyguard and one unit of that. So Oh and they're they're just, they're just running back and forth in a really stupid fashion. These guys are just standing there waiting to die. We will try not to get in their line of fire. Yeah, they're not doing anything, they're just running back and forth. Which is pretty stupid. Uh let's try to get them from behind, just go hit and run. Oh, no, maybe that won't work. Yeah, I'll try to lure them. I'm actually going to move my troops up now. Just a bit. Are you going to... Nope. Okay. Go, get them. Shooting the crap out of these guys. I like how they're just going back and forth and they're not doing anything. Where are these guys coming for us? Come on. We'll pull back a bit. Try to go around the spearmen as much as we can. And these guys are almost pretty much screwed. guys are charging at us. <laughs> what the hell? Why are we taking losses? They have freaking spearmen, okay? Did we kill their general's bodyguard? I'm pretty sure we did. Okay, this guy has only one unit left and uh, I think their general's dead here somewhere. Though there's no notification of it, certainly. Now I'm, gonna, I'm probably going to try to go with my cavalry from behind right here and then I'll move my infantry up to attack them. So it'll just be confusion all around. We have some archers here, some men at arms which are deadly. Though I don't know how they can train them when they take frickin' forever to uh, show up. <coughs> And uh, yeah, I think we killed their general's bodyguard. I think that's him. That's his unit, right there. Okay, well I'm like 99% sure they're dead. Shoot. the hell? Woodsman, what are you doing? Oh! Go! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him. Wow, I was not paying attention to that. <laughs> and we kill their general. That should hit their morale quite hard, and we will move this guy back. Though we didn't lose too many woodsmen, actually. Yeah, we um, we kill their general. It's a pretty fair price. I wasn't surprised. I wasn't expecting this guy to be suicidal and show up. Mounted sergeants. No, are they gonna? Okay, I just gotta be careful here so they don't attack my units. 
pull these guys back with my main body of troops. And we'll go for their other unit of General's bodyguards. And if I outflank them like that, they should be able to route a bit more easily. <coughs> okay. We'll probably move these guys up again. I'm actually going to pull these guys back so I have like my main body of troops together. Are they gonna... Okay, I'll just leave these guys here. Try to lure away their mounted sergeants and then we'll go for their general's bodyguard. <coughs> if we can try to separate them, that would be great. They have uh, some archers right here. So we'll use our main body of troops as a distraction, I guess, of some sort. Are they charging or are they just being stupid again? back and forth like that. That should tire them out a bit more. Give us a slight edge in battle, hopefully. Okay. Now let's try to circle around. Oh, they're coming towards us. Okay, we gotta be careful here, and we will uh, actually move a bit quicker and go right here, and then these guys, who are attacking our main body of troops, should have some fun dealing with us. They're shaking already. We'll move some of these units here, bring these guys up a bit. They're probably going to pussy out at the last second. Go! Not too close! Go! Get him! Journalist bodyguard is coming up to meet us. Excellent. Maybe not, I'm not sure. Pull Piaz Nobles back. Shoot them. We're gonna try to flank these guys. Now let's see what's going on here. And these guys have come up a bit too far, I would say. These guys are routing. These guys can go get them. We'll pull these guys back. move everyone else up <laughs> so we're not isolated like that and we don't lose units unnecessarily oh we routed these guys <laughs> run stand and fight okay get him I'm gonna move these guys here. Go. 
Oh god. Whoa. Run for your life. These guys should go in close quarters. By all attack. Yeah, I'm good thing my general is still alive. Go, run, 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 run. Okay, yeah, nobles aren't doing so well, pull them back. But their general's body are not winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Excellent. These guys are dead. They're dead. These other guys. Whoa. Okay. Let's take a look at our surroundings. Whoa, these guys can outflank these guys easily. These guys can go here. These guys aren't doing anything, so we'll just move here. Woodsmen can go around here. The enemy general lies dead. These we guys sent are screwed. the core to hell. Yeah, master out. There we go. There we go. All right. Yeah, buddy. Let's get their archers. Our Piaz nobles are barely alive, but they gain some nice XP. Everyone's routing. The enemy army runs. Let's we hunt these bastards down. And hunt them down. Yeah, there's no way I'm ransoming them. I'm actually getting these bastards. Look how many of them there are. Holy crap. Get him. Run, bitches. Get my general's bodyguard to swoop in. These guys don't stand a single chance. You see, when you're superior, when you're not superior uh, by technologically, there's a good chance you can still be superior strategically. Scattering. Their archers have almost routed. Get him. Stop firing, damn it. Killing each other. <laughs> Damn it, I told you not to fire. Oh, get these guys. Okay, these guys are almost routed. So many prisoners. I like how the Piaz nobles are like still made it somehow and we still have lots of troops to spare for like reinforcements which is pretty good so we beat the odds yeah <laughs> we took way less losses than I thought we would let's just take a look at the carnage there for a second and there's still guys routing it's hilarious Now these guys haven't done barely anything. We haven't even used all our units, sadly, but we still managed to route these guys. Let's look at all the bodies. 
Our general somehow managed to survive despite me not paying attention. Well, usually that happens even if I do pay attention, they just get hit hard. So some units who are routing. got like over 600 prisoners. Just gonna watch these guys get ridden down. Civilized peoples will be awed by the victory we have won here today. Yeah, buddy. And what a victory. Clear victory? I'd like to be a heroic victory, but okay. Men deployed it slightly less because we didn't use our reinforcements, all of them, but it's still pretty good. We lost only like 300 and something men. Our Pios Nobles healed most of their uh, casualties, I think. But for some reason they didn't, get, didn't gain any experience. Even though it says they did. Some of our other units got some experience, which is nice. And yeah. Caught a lot of prisoners. Alright. Oh, we captured one of their uh, family members. We're still executing them, though. There we go. We got a command star. And we'll pull these guys inside our uh, fortress, I think. My king. Forward. Yes. My lord. These guys are a bit injured. Orders, my king. Okay, and then leaving the army. And we will retrain a lot of these guys. Uh, where where to start? Pios nobles first, then we'll go for this. for like all of them. And that was a pretty epic victory right there. <coughs> Lord High Marshal. Did he just gain that because um Yeah, he might have gained that. Disrespects prisoners. Who cares? Okay, <clears throat> that was a nice victory we had there, and um, because I'm going on vacation in Europe, I might not be continuing this soon. Sire. But I guess I'll just move my spy at least. Moving quietly. No further today. Oh, this is really lightly garrisoned. We can take that pretty easily. And there's this like pathetic army right the here. We're grabbing our army over from over in that was from Vilnius and bring it over to us. Your will shall be obeyed. And then we'll all hell will break loose for the Holy Roman Empire. We'll just move this. We march. 
Make camp here. And yeah, that was a nice victory we had there. And I will see you guys later.